Blackpink Lisa's La Lisa becomes first K-pop solo album to surpass 1.2 billion streams on Spotify. Blackpink Lisa's songs continue to be hugely successful among fans and audiences, enjoying worldwide popularity and setting new records. The superstar from the group Blackpink has proven to be one of the most successful soloists in Asia and now her first single album, La Lisa has surpassed 1.2 billion streams on Spotify with only two tracks becoming the first K-pop soloist album and K-pop debut album in history to reach the milestone. On the other hand, Lisa's Money has now surpassed 850 million streams on Spotify, becoming the first song by a female K-pop act and K-pop soloist to do so in history, getting closer to entering the club, Spotify Billion, which would cause a historic milestone for both South Korea and Thailand. BTS's Jin unexpectedly saves a fan from a robbery. A robber snatched a 21-year-old girl's phone at a bus stop in Brazil and was running off when he discovered a photo of a soldier on the phone's background. He feared that the girl's boyfriend was a military personnel and returned her phone. It turns out the girl was a fan of BTS's Jin and had a photo of him in his mandatory military uniform on her cell phone. The victim told a local media outlet that she was at a bus stop in São José dos Pinhei when the robber approached her, he snatched her cell phone only to discover the photo of BTS's Jin in military uniform. She shared, he must have thought, oh her boyfriend is military, I won't steal. The victim added that the assailant returned her phone and ran away. This story is garnering attention in South Korea as Korean netizens found the story amusing. Netizens commented, Oh my lol, I guess we should all put BTS Jin's photo on our phone background when we travel overseas to avoid being robbed. This is so funny. He's so good looking. I guess he wasn't able to recognize who Jin was. I found a reason to keep Jin's photo as my phone wallpaper. Jin's not only protecting South Korea but he's protecting all armies around the world. He's our special soldier. And Debek, it's the same photo as my phone background. Get ready for episode 15 of Suquita Time to Drink with Suga with another special guest from BTS. Get ready for an exciting 15th episode of Suquita Time to Drink with Suga because the golden maknae of BTS is coming. Following the end of episode 14, Suquita gave a sneak peek into the new episode coming next week. The teaser opened up with a familiar video on Weverse Live. In the video, BTS's Jungkook is seen singing Detwita while demanding that Suga drink with him also. Fulfilling Jungkook's wishes, Suga invites the golden maknae of BTS to spend quality time together on the show. NCT Dreams ISTJ tops iTunes album charts in 20 countries. After its release, NCT Dream's anticipated third full-length album ISTJ entered iTunes charts in various countries worldwide, topping album charts in a total of 20 regions, including Indonesia, Thailand, Cambodia, Czech Republic, Malaysia, Paraguay, Philippines, Singapore, Vietnam, Chile, Brazil, Hong Kong, Ireland, Uzbekistan, Finland, Taiwan, Hungary, Costa Rica, Mexico, and Oman, as of July 19th Korea Standard Time. In addition to NCT Dream topping iTunes charts, the group also broke their personal best in first day sales on Honteo as ISTJ accumulated over 1.1 million copies sold within the day of its release. Meanwhile, ISTJ includes the title track of the same name, the pre-release single Broken Melodies, and the side tracks Yogurt Shake, Skateboard, Blue Wave, Poison, SOS, Pretzel, Starry Night, and Like We Just Met. BB Girls teases fans with a glimpse of their highly anticipated Ray debut. BB Girls recently utilized their social media platforms to generate anticipation for their highly anticipated Ray debut. A captivating image showcases the members Minyang, Yujiang, Yunji, and Yuna seated gracefully on a sofa, attired in stylish and alluring garments. The group is poised to reclaim the spotlight on August 3, 2023, when their Ray debut is scheduled. Zero Base One wins number one on this week's show champion with In Bloom. Zero Base One took home their second music show trophy for their debut title track.
The top five nominees for the champion song on NBC's show champion for the week of July 20th included the groups in Bloom, EXO's Cream Soda, BTS Jungkook's Seven Feet Lotto, and Mix's Party O'Clock, and Shiny's Hard. In the end, Zero Base One ranked number one among the nominees. This marks the group's second music show win for their debut title song, In Bloom, Congratulations to Zero Base One. Nugents take you to their recording studio to show the recording process of Super Shy. Nugents is rising above, becoming one of the most popular fourth-generation girl groups in the K-pop industry. Since their surprise entrance to the K-pop world with the unannounced release of Attention, the quintet has been taking the world by storm, the girls have been climbing higher on global music charts with each new release. On July 19th, Nugents revealed the captivating journey through the recording process of their latest hit, Super Shy. In the latest behind-the-scenes video, Nugents opened their studio doors to share the creative process that birthed this soul-stirring track. Each member thoughtfully sang their own respective part best to convey the emotions and message of the track while bringing the song harmoniously together. The boys to release their second full album next month. The boys will be returning with the release of their second full album next month, IST Entertainment confirmed on July 20th Korea Standard Time. The group's comeback arrives approximately six months after the release of their eighth mini-album Be Awake in February of this year. And in the midst of their ongoing second world tour, Zeneration. In terms of a full-length album, it will mark the first in approximately three years and six months since the release of Reveal in February of 2020. Stay tuned for the boys' second full album, coming on August 7th.